Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am cleaning and reorganizing our mud room. Now, as you can see, there are shoes all over the place and the decorations that are up, while yes, Americana can be used all year round, it is definitely not the 4th of July, so. <laughs> So all of these flags and the shoes have just completely taken over the floor and the space has really kind of lacked a true identity and it just was not the most welcoming of spaces coming into the house. So it was time for a refresh, a cleanup, and again, it needed to be a space for us to look forward to since it's the first room in the house. So. If you want to see how I clean, reorganize, and refresh our mudroom entryway, definitely keep watching. Okay, first it's time to clear the space. And a lot of the things that were built up in the entryway were things that needed to go into the garage or into our cars. and they just never seem to make it there. Also, our shoes, since we don't wear shoes in the house, it was great to be able to have a drop zone for our shoes, but because we didn't have a solid shoe rack or organizer, everything just seemed to go everywhere. <laughs> now, my husband gets on me all the time about buying something that is going to last and to not always look for the cheapest deal and while yes he loves my bargain shopping sometimes I'll admit I can kind of go on the cheap side <laughs> as I did with this shoe rack from five below that really just did not withstand the test of time <laughs> with our kids but it was a quick fix for the meantime and now it was just time to completely revamp the entryway mud room. Now the entry rug that I had, I actually purchased it from Target and I really loved the rug but I really wanted a rug for the front door on the outside so I decided that I would use that one on the outside and purchase a new one for the inside. Part of it too was the rug was kind of shedding and it was just adding on to the mess that was already in the mud room. So I figured it would be better outside. Okay, so this is all the dirt and grime that I swept up in that mud room. And as gross as it is to see, <laughs> I'm so happy to know that the mud room is cleaned and all of the little debris and things are contained into one space as opposed to all over our house. So, To clean the walls and remove any marks, I'm using these erasers from the Dollar Tree. I love these for my walls, my baseboards, and just any markings, especially with my busy kids in the house. To freshen up the entryway, I'm using this Everspring all-purpose spray from Target. And I really, really love the way it smells. It's a fresh lemon clean. And I like that it's not chemicals or harming uh, for the kids. And speaking of my kids, have you ever tried to assemble an Ikea furniture or just furniture in general and your child is trying to help you? <laughs> Well, this is exactly what my little girl was trying to do, help <laughs> in her own special way. So it's already challenging enough, I must admit, to assemble furniture. But when you have a little toddler or your, your helping hand trying to uh, chip in, it's needless to say, things get interesting. <laughs> Thank you. 
So this is a few days later and I wanted to give the entryway one more sweep before I started to bring everything in and definitely the amount of debris was nothing like how it was before. <laughs> Now this rug I purchased from Target and I love that it's neutral and it's not going to shed. It's a rubber rug. And here are the finished shoe racks that I was able to finally assemble <laughs> that we purchased from Ikea. And the basket that I put on the side has all of our sandals in. I figured it would be better for us to kind of contain all the sandals into the basket as opposed to trying to fit them onto the shoe rack since we had so many shoes and it worked out for us. Now as I'm putting the shoes away here I'm putting all of the family members each family members shoes together so all of my husband's shoes together my shoes and the kids along the top and for my youngest daughter since her shoes are still rather small and they would kind of just go right through um, the shoe rack. I organized them in this dish pan that I purchased from the Dollar Tree and it just makes it so much easier even to for her to grab her own shoes. To keep the entryway fresh I am putting this Renews It scent as well as this moisture eliminator that I purchased both from the Dollar Tree and I'm kind of sliding them here at the bottom to be kind of inconspicuous, but it'll help to kind of contain any moisture in the entryway as well as to give it a nice aroma when we enter the house. So I took the hanger that was originally there. It was actually there from the prior owners uh, when we bought the house and I decided to give it a new look by spray painting it white. And since it is fall, at least in a few days, <laughs> I thought, you know, it's the perfect time to start decorating. So I purchased this garland from the Dollar Tree and I've actually had it for a few years now and I just thought it was a nice kind of warm uh, refresh for the entryway. And the wall decal is another purchase from the Dollar Tree. I just love these little vinyl decals that I can move all around and change up the decor. For the window on the opposite side, I am adding items that I purchased from the Target Dollar Spot, Dollar Tree, as well as things that I already had on hand. And this is the finished entryway mudroom. I am so happy with the way it came out. It is clean, it is organized, it has a designated place for everything now, and it's completely welcoming when we first come into the house. So I really love the way this wall hanging came out. It's a perfect place for my kids to hang up their book bags when they come home from school. And I just really love the addition of our family picture as well as just some pictures for the fall. And I plan on switching that out during the seasons. And I really love how the window decorations came out. This home sweet home sign I actually purchased from the Target Dollar Spot recently and I thought it was just the perfect addition to a lot of the decor that I already had on hand. And this window just feels so warm and so welcoming along with the entryway. So I was really happy to see, again, everything just kind of complement each other and for this space to have a clear identity of where things are supposed to go and what exactly the room is so I hope that you enjoyed this video and if you did enjoy this video go ahead and click that like button it really helps my channel and if you're new to my channel I hope you consider subscribing and joining our daily SS milk community and until the next video I hope that you guys are having a great day take care